Their scheme is a very new and unique scheme where boxers can actually come and train for full time whilst coupling that with full time education as well. So they would come to us and aspiring elite boxers would um, have high level coaching with like minded boxers, um, hopefully developing them so much that they can reach their own personal goals but also hoping to get them into things like um, GB squads eventually and, and hopefully beyond. My involvement here is to ensure I facilitate that. that I not only try and get them up to the next level, but ensure that they stay focused with their academics and that they have a, essentially a fallback plan. However, I do. A lot of people do see this the academics as a fallback plan, but I actually see it as, as one of my prime goals: ensure that they do get the education first, and they have options like going into higher education, such as university. Um, but for me, the bonus would be developing them to the next level and getting people into the GB squads. But if we can have both, then it's, it's the icing on the cake. The brief I gave to the film students was twofold, basically. One was we needed raw footage so the boxers could actually reflect upon that footage for their portfolio for the level 3 MVQ and excellence in sporting performance. So as an elite athlete they should be reflecting upon what they're doing, action planning it as a result of those reflections and then going away and doing it and that creates a full cycle all the time. So it's plan, do, evaluate, plan, do, evaluate and keep doing, keep following that cycle to improve. Um, so we needed that evidence from, from the film crews to ensure they can analyse their their technique, their tactics, any mental strengths that may have in the physicality. Um, in terms of the, the second side of that is that we wanted an, an edit, a, a motivational video that we could we could use for so the boxes could actually put it on their iPods, etc., their iPhones. To absolutely promote the scheme, and what we're looking at at the end of the day, we, we do want more boxers in. And the more boxers we in, we get in, the higher the standards, uh, the more everybody works with each other, and new, new talents that other boxers have uh, will come in and improve the standard that we have here. This is an elite scheme. Um, we do have some novice boxers, but we also have some elite boxers. We're hoping to raise that standard up. But saying that as well, um, we will still accept novices because for them personally, it's all about them getting to their next level. Now that's not going to be GB. That will be maybe having a certain amount of bouts within a season or eventually going into the novice championships. So it's all, it, it, it's all very relative. Gary, Barbara and I now are very, very clear about where we want this to go, what we want everyone involved to do, um, and because that's clear, everyone seems to be getting on well. And it's not just a case of, right, come on guys, you need to get together and speak about this. They're doing it off their back, and that was one of the main goals that we had, is to make sure everyone's quite autonomous about this, and, and taking care of their own projects, rather than us standing behind them with a whip and a chair and telling them to get this sorted with deadlines. Everyone seems to be doing a lot more this year, and there's, there's a passion about it. And some of the, the samples that I've seen from the filmmakers, um, it's fantastic, and it's not even near to be finished yet, so there's still so much to be done within there, and so much more quality to be put into to the final piece, and, and everyone's really passionate about it. Uh, and because they're passionate about it, they work, they work together a lot more. So um, it's really took off this year, and like I think it's because we're a little bit more clear about how we want this, this project to go. Are our brains a little bit more turned on now? We're definitely going to run it again next year. Um, we will see these results coming soon, and the results will speak for themselves. I, I think it's still a little bit under the radar what we're doing here at the moment, um, but once we see these physical evidence, these results of what we do, and how everyone's working together, uh, how it's benefited our course and the filmmakers' course, then people won't be able to sort of um, look away from it, they'll see oh, this is some fantastic stuff. Yeah, and, and of course it's, it's adding to everyone's qualification as well, it's a major part of their qualification. So that's a great thing. In terms of what, what I would do better, um, I would like it to go more along the lines of everybody, there's, there's the scheme of work that we're following, go and do it. So we've kind of gone along, gone along the, 
we tell you, you do, but it is slowly transferring to be a bit more student-led now, and we want that to be a little bit more early on, so we can just essentially, Gary and I can sit back and oversee what's going on and, and watch the results and perhaps just put the odd bit of advice in or maybe add our own little point of view or opinion in, um, and it'd be completely student-led.